came to Pittsburgh in the fall of 2008 um, to attend law school at the University of Pittsburgh. Um, fell in love with the city and one of the reasons I fell in love with the city is because I discovered the presence um, of a huge um, nonprofit sector um, within the city. I believe it's one of the largest in the country. Um, you know, at school I was surrounded by individuals who you know, shared a similar passion for nonprofit work, um, work in public interest, um, and you know, through 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 volunteering at different organizations, I came upon YNPN. Um, the president of our organization, Todd um, Todd Whiteman, um, introduced me to the organization. Um, described some of the resources that they were hoping to offer individuals in my position, um, individuals who had a passion um, but lacked really the resources, the tangible and intangible resources, to become more intimately involved um, and become successful and become a contributing member of that community. Um, again, in those conversations, I realized both the, the academic and educational courses that YNPN offered and equally important, the mentorship opportunities that the program uh, made available to individuals in my position. Um, you know, through YNPN, I, I was matched with another attorney interested and in, who participated actively in the nonprofit and public interest community. Um, and through that, you know, I, I had an individual I could turn to when I had questions, um, an individual who offered their assistance to me. Um, and now, now today, four years later, um, I'm working for that individual in a professional capacity and upon graduation. Um, and that was an outcome, um, a result that was only possible because of the resources made available by the Young Nonprofit Professionals Network. Um, I think this, th this group has provided so far and is moving even more towards um, providing a springboard um, to all of the resources um, in the nonprofit community. Um, whether those resources are directly provided by uh, YNPN, such as the mentorship program, um, or whether they're um, ed educational um, and continued learning education opportunities um, hosted by other organizations. Uh, YNPN has done a remarkable job thus far and is continuing to do a great job solidifying partnerships with these other nonprofit um, entities in the city. Um, and in doing so, YNPN has acted as a bridge for me to, to become more involved and to improve my myself um, by those resources. Um, I think one of, you know, especially upon, you know, I, I recently graduated and as, as we all know, we're in one of the worst, you know, economic states um, in, you know, in a generation. Um, and what I believe that has done is driven even more individuals into uh, the nonprofit sector. Um, less likely are we upon graduation either from our undergraduate universities or upon our graduate programs, um, less likely are we um, inclined to accept a job that we have no interest in um, simply because a large annual salary is attached to it. Um, because those options are less available right now, more of us are, are choosing um, to pursue this passion, to pursue these passions into the nonprofit sector. Um, and it's just an, it's an exciting time because of that for the entire industry. Um, and now that there's more individuals um, looking to move into that into that sector than ever um, it's important for for programs like YNPN um, to, to exist and to operate effectively to, to help each of us you know benefit and to succeed as much as possible um, and it's just encouraging to see that there is an organization such as this uh, in place in the city of Pittsburgh to to help our graduating students and to help our to help all individuals of all ages who want to tackle the, the nonprofit sector. Again, I, I came to I came to the city of Pittsburgh, um, a stranger. Um, didn't 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 know anyone in the city. Fell in love with the city. Um, grabbed a grabbed a sandwich at Permanis. Um, felt just fell in love with the city. Fell in love with the community and and the, and the closeness that both it and the individuals within it provided. Um, you know, again, I was I was blessed to find a a resource. Um, to find the connections and the networking and the and the individuals that had, had that had come together within YNPN and to find find a base of individuals that I could learn from that I could network with that I could offer my services to um, and in the same way take advantage of the, the help and the assistance they provided um, you know be, be, because of my involvement as as a member in the organization um, and I believe my my, my, my passion and the, the offerings and the skill set that I offered, I was asked to become part 
of the board of directors of YNPN. And again, it's just been a, it's been a absolute blessing now to take a more leadership position in the direction of this organization. And I am very excited with the direction that the organization is moving and to, to remain intimately involved for years to come. We have, we have a website, ynpn.org, and as well as a LinkedIn page and a Facebook page. Um, you can find, you know, find us, find us easily, connect with us, and um, instantly upon joining the group, um, you'll start receiving updates and information as to the resources that YNPN provides.